Hey guys, it's Anne over at Plan Obsessed, and I am going to make another worm tower, but this time I'm going to make a big one to put at the base of my big apple tree. And um, so what I have here is a yield uh, bucket and a lid and a drill with a quarter inch bit. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to drill around the bottom and a couple on the top and the sides. And then um, this way I can put fallen apples in there so that I quit collecting wasps and etc. Uh, when the apples fall, I can put them directly into this bucket underneath my apple tree. And then the worms will have something to eat. The hole should not be big enough in order to get uh, any sort of mole or vole and I'm going to tightly put the lid down so that nothing else can get into it hopefully. So I'm going to get started and I will probably do some sort of uh, music or something while I'm doing my drilling because nobody likes to hear that. So here we go. As you can see, there are some fallen apples in here um, in the area where it's so dense that um, no grass grows. So hopefully my husband does not hit this with the lawnmower. I'll try and make it as close to the tree as I can. Um, I don't know. What do you think? Probably a better idea if I put it over here near the big hosta. He wouldn't dare hit that with the lawnmower. Yep, that's a good idea. I will put that next to the big hosta. So I will put you down, dig a hole, and then show you how I'm going to get it started. So here we go. All of the holes are below the soil line. You can see I've already got some worms hanging out. So now let's get something in here to get it started. I think these are actually last year's. Okay, that's enough to get started. It's due to rain today, so it will definitely get watered in. I put a little dirt in there to weigh things down a little. But uh, other than that, there we go. Let me get the lid on. And then I'll show it to you guys. That hostel will probably get big enough to cover it for the most part, um, but it'll be out of the mowing path, and then anytime there's fallen apples or weeds, I can shove it in there. All right, guys. Well, that's all it takes uh, to create an outside worm tower uh, that can help you keep your garden clean. So, if you like the video, give it a muddy thumbs up. If you're not a member of the worm family, click that subscribe button. And if you want to know what I'm doing when I'm doing it, ring that bell icon. All right, guys, thanks for hanging out with me and my worms. And everybody, have a good day.